joining us on the International Space Station. Oh my goodness, this is such a pleasure. So it is an honor to meet you all. This is amazing. What an experience. And thank you very much for uh, coming out to the Johnson Space Center today and uh, looking at some of the work we're doing for human space exploration. And you're talking to us now on the only human outpost in space. I'm uh, Commander Drew Feustel. Next to me is uh, Alex Gerst, our uh, European Space Agency astronaut from Germany. He's taken over as commander in a couple of days here, about two weeks. Next to me uh, on my right is Oleg Artemyev. He is the uh, Soyuz commander of our spacecraft that will be heading home on October 4th. Behind me is uh, Serena Anand Chancellor, American astronaut, who's uh, got another five, four months to go on space station, as well as, as, well as uh, Sergei Prokofiev. Uh, commander of the other Soyuz spacecraft that will take Alex and Serena home eventually. And then in the back, we have uh, Ricky Arnold, the uh, assistant to the commander, uh, who is uh, flying with us and returning home on October 4th as well. Amazing. Doesn't October? Commander, but, you know. October 4th. So you're coming home soon, or at least some of you are. Yeah, three of us will be coming home uh, in just a few weeks, and we've been up here for about, we'll have been up here for uh, 198 days. Just incredible. Well, obviously, one of the reasons we're here is to see the unbelievable work that's being done by NASA and by the whole organization and um, in advancement of our, our goals towards space exploration and um, ultimately the President's goals of returning humans to, to the moon. So do you have anything you want to share with us about, about your experience at the International Space Station as astronauts? And, and then we're talking to some students a little bit later on who are interns here at the Johnson Space Center. So if you have any words of advice that I can relay to them, it would be great if you could share with us. I'd say our message is pretty consistent. We all believe in what we're doing up here, and we think it's important to the continuation of the, the human species, and um, also the science that we're doing on, in space is all really designed to make uh, life better uh, on Earth and allow us to be better uh, as people as we take care of the planet and also move out into the solar system. I think we all believe that what we do is going to be critical to carrying on the legacy of, of our species. We haven't been on Earth very long compared to how long Earth has been around, and uh, we just hope to be able to continue the awesome science that we're doing up here and to inspire the youth of our, not only our nation but nations around the world to think about uh, the things that they can do to contribute to humanity and science and technology and advancing our, our existence out into the solar system. So thanks for your interest and your support. We certainly appreciate it and hope that you enjoy your time uh, learning about what we do uh, for space exploration and humans in space. Well, thank you. And just know you can't limit it to youth because I think I can speak for all of us here to say that you inspire us all. And you actually have my dream job. I always wanted to be an astronaut, and I always want to go to space. So <laughs> you, are, you are fulfilling my dream up there. But um, and I guess never say never, right? Right, Administrator? <laughs> Thanks. Thank you both for joining us, and uh, we hope that you're proud of the work that we're doing, and we're trying to uh, carry on the legacy that's been going on up here for the last 18 years. The International Space Station is certainly a fantastic laboratory in space, and it's an amazing collaboration, an international collaboration between our European partners and uh, our international partners, especially the, the Russians as well, that really make this uh, happen for us and allow us to have access to space right now. And we look forward to continued operations together uh, internationally and cooperatively, and we hope this serves as a great model to continue out the exploration. Thank you so much. Thank you all. And for those of you coming back to Earth, we'll, we'll welcome you home in, in October. And, and for the rest of you, just thank you for all that you're doing.